Thank you very okay. much. So it never ceases to amaze me at the talents of people in this area. Mm -hmm. So far in uh, my series, Public Jobs, Hidden Talents, we've showed you a radio newsman with an amazing memory and a college president with a musical flair. Well, in this morning's In Search Of, we are spotlighting an educator who is one iron man. Abby Mitch, how are you guys doing? Good, thanks. To most people here, he's known as Mr. Flagg. You bet. My name is Jeff Flagg. I'm associate principal at La Crosse Central High School. Do you need to see me? You never know what your day is going to be like, and that's one of the really exciting things I really enjoy about it. Got it? Yeah. All right, we'll see ya. In his 13 years as an area educator, Mr. Flagg has walked countless miles up and down the halls of the schools he's worked at. He just walk all day long. But that is nothing compared to the miles he's racked up outside of his day job. I was a cross country and track runner in high school, ran a cross country and track in college at lacrosse. Hi there. But a few years back, when Jeff got bored with simply running, he threw biking and swimming into the mix, and a triathlete he became. I work out twice a day. I usually the alarm goes off at 4 a.m. Off to the pool or out for a run and then it's off to work. How are you doing? I look forward to getting home at night and uh, getting out for a 30 minute, 60 minute workout, whatever I have time to get in and then it's not uncommon for me to do four, five, six hours on, on Saturday, Sunday maybe three or four hours. For those of you not familiar with triathlons, there are several different levels. Short distances, which are still very tough for most. I use those more for workouts and to, to test my fitness level a little bit. There's also an intermediate course, and then there's the mother of them all, the Iron Man. 2.4 miles swimming, 112 biking, 26.2 mile run. <laughs> Jeff's done them all and won many, but it didn't start out that way. No, no. <laughs> wasn't very good. Uh, I put a good three, four years in before I really started to see some success. Triathlon is an interesting sport. It's kind of a journey. Um, there's ups, there's downs. The cool thing about this, I have nobody else to blame but myself when I, when, when I don't perform well, and that's what I really like. Never really enjoyed team sports because I did not like having to rely on somebody else whether or not I won or lost. But the exciting thing is never being satisfied. You got to keep working hard, and you, you just can't give up. Whether school... The guys got to wear black, girls got to wear maroon. Or sport, working hard is all Mr. Flagg knows. Seems that's the sign of an Iron Man indeed. In La Crosse, Jennifer Livingston. News Channel 8. I can't, I can't even tell you how difficult the Iron Man would be. Only, the only comparison I have, and you have a little comparison, mm -hmm. is that we've, I've done a full itty bitty triathlon, the right. smallest one, and Jeff actually helped me with my training. Mm -hmm. He sent me workouts every week, of which I almost cried when I'd look at what <laughs> I would, would have to do. Yeah. Now, you heard him say he uses those, those short ones as his, just his workouts. Yeah, just he's kind like, of I do little, those, yeah. you know. He's already done one Iron Man this year. He plans to do at least one more this season, and his best time wow. so far in the event, which again, it's a 2.4 mile swim, 112 mile bike, and a full marathon, 26.2 mile I, run. I can't imagine. He did it in 10 hours, 10 and a half hours. Wow, that's impressive. 10 and a half hours of working out straight. So he's pretty amazing. He's <laughs>